or YouTube. It is already one o'clock. This morning I have been working on a project with some students reviewing the accuracy of information on videos on YouTube and we're doing one looking at something called atopic dermatitis, also known as eczema. Um, but there are a few uh, videos on YouTube that have some useful content but then intermingled in there is a lot of misleading information so um, it's quite scary. But anyways, so I just made myself some of the uh, scrambled egg beaters and I'm gonna have some of that toast and I'm watching Ernest Saves Christmas on Netflix and then I'm gonna go check the mail. So yesterday I um, <laughs> went berserk at Costco, admittedly. All in all though, I got some good deals so I thought I'd show you that. And my iHerb order came and I also got a Christmas card in the mail so I thought I'd do a little unboxing and I guess haul type thing. Oh how sweet, y'all, an ornament. The guys, it's the truck with the tree. How did she know? Oh, y'all know I love that. Oh, thank you. I, ooh, this is a big size of my PB2. So I am in love with these kelp noodles, guys. Have you tried them? They are divine. And then this was a really good price. So I decided to get this instead of Quest just to try something different. 24 grams of protein, only one gram of sugar. Packaged Chipino. All right, so now I'll show you guys what I got from Costco. So, uh, first and foremost, I got the Ferrero Rochers to make my pineapple. I love the Starbucks Vias, guys. I have an unfortunate gum chewing habit you may have detected, and it's a character flaw that I've accepted about myself. I like the Stride gum, but I also like this Orbitz gum. So, they got these guys in a color scheme that I was looking for, and I, I really like the pattern. I don't know if this brand is gonna be any good, but I'll put it on my bed and see how I like it. All right, and lately my Costco delivering on clothing. Their loungewear and activewear selection has really been uh, great. I picked up the sweatshirt and the brand is Buffalo by David Bitten and it's so soft. It feels like, like a baby blanket. All right, and so you may have picked up on the fact that I also enjoy doing crafts. And yesterday I showed you guys that they had this adorable Rudolph crochet set. I'm so excited for this, guys. It's got everything you need to make the sweet little Santa and the reindeer, and then the instructions for all the characters. I'm so excited. It's even got the cute little, like, that funny polka dot elephant thing from the Misfit Toys. Oh, I'm so excited to make these. I could not pass this up, I know. I mean, it's intended for children ages eight and over, but when I saw this glittery unicorn, I just had to have it, guys. It comes with all the little clay, which is air drying. Like, check out that sweet little frog. And look how cute the little barnyard magnets are, the little lamb. Okay, guys, I'm loving this comforter. I just think it looks great with my bed. I've been inside working all day, and I'm <laughs> getting a little antsy, so I'm running out. I need to get a gift for my uh, medical assistants, because tomorrow's actually gonna be the last day that I see her. Browsing in here, Pier 1. The Christmas stuff is 20% off, but I know the day after Christmas it's all gonna be 50% off. So. It's a salt and pepper shaker, isn't that adorable? <laughs> Look at the Texas reindeer, guys. Who is that? Well, hey there, guys. I am back. Went to the gym, got a shower in. Just uh, working here on the uh, the Dubo laptop mambo combo with my work. Guys, I'm pretty jazzed about this Seafair Pacific West Coast Chipino. I don't know if I'm gonna crack into this tonight or not. I'm undeclared at this point as far as dinner plans. I'm loving the idea of this, though, because it's a rich source of omega-3 fatty acids. So one of you guys asked a very astute question about my thoughts on bio oil. Interestingly, we've learned that patients with acne have lower levels of essential fatty acids in the lipid component and the oils of their skin. So there is a lot of interest in looking towards botanical sources of omega-3 fatty acids and omega-6 fatty acids and I just want to share with you here are some lists that, of um, things like borage oil, canola oil, canola oil, fish oil, rosehip seed oil, um, evening primrose oil, grapeseed oil, these are just a few oils that have omega-3 fatty acids and omega-6 fatty acids. But as far as the acne research, it, it still needs some work, but um, there, there is good reason to give it a whirl. And it, it, 
uh, scientifically make sense. If you're not familiar with bio oil, here's a picture of the product. On Ulta, you can get it, a 4.2 ounce bottle, now on sale for $16.99. And in looking at the ingredients, it contains sunflower seed oil and soybean oil, which are natural sources of some of these essential fatty acids. So I hope that addresses your question, and um, please comment below, guys, if you've used this and, and what your experience was, but I, I hear a lot of enthusiasm for facial oils. Anyways, that's going to conclude the vlog for today, guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, comment below. Share this video with your friends. Give it a thumbs up, and as always, don't forget, sunscreen and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye!